Shkaltungo, established over a century ago, used to be the only higher learning institution in the area until the approval for the establishment of a federal polytechnic. It's a joyous moment for the host community and the entire state as the federal government officials visit the area to inspect the permanent and temporary sites ahead of the takeoff. <laughs> this further attests to the reality of the development. The feelers we are getting, honestly, is that really we have, we have met all the requirements for takeoff and permanent site. The Polytechnic shall have powers and perform such functions conferred on it by the Act as a corporate body with perpetual succession and commercial. The main function of the Polytechnic shall be to provide full-time and part-time courses of instructions and training, as well as produce middle and high-level manpower in technology, applied sciences, commerce, and management. While Kaltungo Model School will serve as a temporary site, the state government has allocated over 100 hectares of land for the permanent site. Already the site for both the takeoff and the permanent site have been acquired. So what remains for the polytechnic is for recruitment of uh, the key personnel for them to come and start academic activity, which I believe will be done almost immediately. So we thank God. We appreciate all that you did. And inshallah, want to send a message, not only to the Honorable Minister, but to Mr. President and Nigerians at large, that Gwambe is ready. Kaltungo is ready. A former lawmaker who sponsored the bill is happy to see his effort come to reality. God has uh, seen the yearnings of the people here who have had a history of Western education so early when others did not know the benefits. We embraced it, but along the line we lost the advantage that we used to have. But God looked upon our yearning and he answered our prayers and granted this the people of Kaltungo community believe that the Federal Polytechnic will bring desired development to the area as well as enhance the economy of the state.